Now, President Xi offered his thoughts on the upcoming summit in a piece that appeared in Korea's major daily newspapers on this Thursday. The written contribution, which uh, encourages greater cooperation between Seoul and Beijing and expresses high hopes for the summit, echoes the sentiments voiced by President Park a day earlier during her interview with Chinese broadcaster CCTV. Our UDN reports. Chinese President Xi Jinping begins his piece with a traditional Korean saying, it only costs three straw bags to buy a house, but a thousand to get a good neighbor, emphasizing the importance of having good neighbors. He goes on to say that Seoul and Beijing have been able to build a healthy relationship based on trust, adding the two should always be able to freely exchange opinions on areas of mutual interest. President Xi also calls economic cooperation the main focal point of Korea-China relations and says China is aiming to expand its economic ties with Seoul through speedy negotiations on their bilateral FTA. As for his visit to Seoul, he writes that he hopes the two leaders will share a friendship, discuss cooperation and preserve peace. His words were echoed a day earlier by Korean President Park Geun-hye during an interview with China CCTV, where she expressed hope that the visit will bring relations between the two to a new high. When asked about Korea's ongoing historical dispute with Japan, President Park simply said Tokyo needs to have a correct understanding of history. She also accused Tokyo of trying to undermine the 1993 Kono Statement, which was its official apology for forcing roughly 200,000 women into sexual slavery during World War II. 신뢰를 저버리는 일이고 또 국제 사회의 그 준엄한 그런 그 어떤 목소리에 목소리를 무시하는 그런 행위라고 생각을 합니다. 그래서 일본은 이제라도 어떻게 역사의 수레바퀴를 되돌릴 수는 도저히 없는 것이기 때문에 Japan's recent attempts to revise history and economic cooperation between China and Korea will top the agenda of the summit between the two leaders. Yurian, Arirang News.